So the interviewer gives you the following piece of code and asks you what will be the output. As you all can see, we have created a variable called ARR and we are assigning an array to it, which has three elements, Walter, Skylar, and Jesse. On the following line, we are using the push method on that variable ARR, and we are pushing a new element called Gus, and we are assigning it to a variable called new ARR, okay? And then finally, we are console logging that new variable. So give it a moment. Ready? Now the output might be a bit shocking for a lot of people who haven't seen this kind of a question before, but the output to this question is four, okay? Now, if you're confused, I totally get it. Uh, even I was when I saw this question for the first time, but we need to understand what the push method returns. Okay, so the push method doesn't actually return the new array after inserting Gus in this o in this variable ARR, but instead it will return the length of this variable ARR after inserting Gus. So prior to this, the length was three. Now we added Gus, so the length became four, and that is what is returned by this push method. Okay, so basically what we are seeing is the length of this variable ARR. Okay, and let me just add that to the console. We got four elements, right? And this four is nothing but a length of this ARR variable. 